a place a place for people to communicate and for the data to be captured. So a lot of a lot of this communication between people um, happens verbally or it happens when you're standing around a whiteboard, but then it's never sort of captured formally. Like being able to capture that information um, and store it means we can go back and understand why we made a certain decision. From using threads, I see it's um, it's changed a bit the dynamic of how you can sort of structure your your interactions with people. So in the past with, with other tools, it's very um, sort of group-minded or direct emails and chats and things like that. Um, but it's the topics go all over the place and then people get frustrated finding the information they had. So the thing I like about threads is that it's, it's sort of you force the topic, so to speak. Um, and then everything in that thread topic is related to only that. So Enabling them to be more resilient and responsive and respond to changes in teams, changes in disruptions and supply chains uh, and, and things like that. And I think actually that also plays in really to, to uh, net zero and climate change because by increasing the efficiency of manufacturing operations and being more streamlined in that, that leads on to, to resource efficiency I think overall. Information is available, um, it's easy for your organisation to access. So, and it's, and it's tracked, that's the most important thing. Is often, especially when a project goes a lot longer, people forget things. Um, and it's good to be able to go back and search. We would like to move to a space where we're doing as much of the, the design, the manufacturing, the, you know, going into service, but do it all digitally. You know, once we can do as much of that digitally as possible, um, we can have a much more agile way of working. This kind of So after a, a 30 minute initial briefing, or not even 30 minutes, a, a quick recap of how threads work with the rest of the team. Um, we generate 22 threads um, with our team of 34 people. You know, after a week, we sort of, things fluctuated a bit, but uh, we overall tracked nearly 125 different changes. Uh, lots of events over 50, um, including decisions, uh, issues, actions, such, and resolutions, such like that. Um, but all this happened without a single meeting. Uh,